Okay. This game is also a game I got from the devs. They gave me a key to try it out. It's called Streets of Rogue. I think it might be a roguelike fighter kind of thing. Uh, keyboard or gamepad? Let's do gamepad first, maybe. Oh, gamepad setup. Wow, look at that screen resolution, though. I can't change it. Okay. Sure, it looks fine. What's up, Josh? No, I can't come play Phasma with you right now. I will have nightmares and not be able to sleep even more problem than I'm having now. Once home to peace and prosperity, the city has fallen into the hands of a ruthless and dictatorial... A dictator... A dictatorial... I can barely pronounce it. Mayor. Cuddle Yeti, he looks cuddly. <laughs> Elected on vague promises of lower taxes or and more beer, his true colors began to show immediately upon his inauguration. The mayor's first executive orders were a massive raise on taxes and a one-time confiscation of all alcoholic beverages. He stated that the confiscation was so he could throw the mother of all ragers for his constituents. But in reality, there was only like one keg and a bag of tortilla chips. It was super lame. All right. This game already has my attention. He used the money and extra booze to fund a private army of goons, happy to carry out his every nefarious bidding. Before long, the city had fallen into a state of chaos, but there is still hope. A secretive organization only known as, or known only as the Resistance, has been formed to fight against the mayor's tyrannical leadership, and that is where your tale begins. It is time to embark on your journey into the streets of Rogue. Oh, listen to this. Okay. I'm not controlling this, by the way. So, you want to join the resistance, eh? Well, there's something you should know. Our standards for entry are extremely high. I'd offer words of encouragement, but I seriously doubt that we're going to get very far. Your first task is to move around. Use the left stick. You think you can handle this? Oh, look at me moonwalking. Well, they're muddy or uh, slippy. Holy crap, you did it. Now open that door by pressing the interact button A. No way, no way. This is the farthest anyone's gotten in a long time. A little, I left a little something for you in that chest. Can you figure out what to do next? Lockpick. Wow, oh my God, but. There is no way that you could possibly figure out what to do with that thing. Uh, lockpick. Let's go. Holy crap! Holy, holy crap! Ah! He exploded. A guy exploded from excitement. Okay. Oh no! He spontaneously exploded. I am so sorry you had to see that. On the plus side, you must be doing pretty well so far for him to get that... excited. He had a lot of emotional problems. Anyways, the music comes back. No use mopping around. I'll take over from here. I'm telling Purdy you some money. Use it to buy a hacking tool from our staff shopkeeper. I'm gonna go loot his goop. Or not. The controls are very slippy. Like, you can see me slide. That's after I've stopped using the directional pad. What are you buying? The only thing that you have available. Thanks! Access your inventory by pressing X. Then press A to select the hacking tool. Use the right stick to aim your target at the computer and press A. Computer. What oh, computer? Oh, that one. This, this, this. Read email. That would be rude. I'm going to send you a little trial mission to see what. But it is, press Y. 
destroy gold bar. Summoning is on guard duty the building past this fence. To see more info on it, hold A. Hostile. Looks like I won't be too happy to see you. And by the way, ooh, what's this? If someone's name is yellow, it means they own the property by teleporting you to wall bypasser. Now use the confirm your toolbar. Press the directional button that corresponds to its slot. Yeah, not quite. Here's another one. Oh. Doink. Typically, a red, red door means people don't want you in there. I need another one. Meet our staff bouncer. He'll be playing the part of bad guy. But he's been striking not to fight back under any circumstances. Hello, nice to meet your acquaintance. Rookie, feel free to wail on him as hard as you can. He's a big guy, he can take it. Um, excuse me, but I don't recall agreeing to this. When you signed your resistance paperwork, perhaps you recall section 7C, which states members are subject to any and all the resistance leaders, illogical, dangerous, and or sadistic whims. Look, you have no right to allow some random guy up the street to take shots at me for the sakes of some... What did you call it? Tutorial? We can do whatever we want to you. We're the ones in charge. You know, this is the same sort of ridiculous authoritarian crap the mayor pulls. That's what I was thinking. Stop being a wimp. You'll be fine. We gave you that sweet hard hat, remember? Fair enough. Oh! You can punch the lovable root by facing forward. Right trigger. Punch. Boom, boom. Grab the weapon. Give him a good whack. Aw, oh, come on. Whack, whack, whack. Grab the tranquilizer gun and cycle it using my right bumper. Nap time. Use the right stick to aim to put a few darts in him. Hey, he ran away. Oh, he hiding. I'm sorry, dude. Bonk. Said put a few. Ah, uh, sleep it like a baby, by the way. Do you see that blue meter at the top of your screen? You'll get skill points for things like murdering and lock fixing. Okay. Well, that's good to know. Now what? That's great. I can't. Um, did I break the game already? Oh, that door. Now walk through the red sensor. It's totally safe and not harmful at all. Tee hee. Yeah, I don't believe you. Ouch! Tripwire. Ah! I'm sorry. I couldn't resist. That never gets old. I hope you're okay. Take this bacon cheeseburger. You can use your... Quick use your health items by pressing B. Yum. Here's something you can use to deal with the laser a little more safely. Just use it like you did the other weapons. Rock. What the fuck? I hit myself with it? Oh man, hitting that sucks. What the fuck? Whoa, did you not learn what just happened? I'm trying to pick up the rock. There it goes. There it goes. I'm going to give you a really cool special ability that you can use. Tee hee, open the door to use it. Press left trigger. Wah, wah, bah. This special ability can be used with cry profusely. I mean, that's not very useful at all, is it? Check it out on your stat screen. Press back. <sighs> he actually gave that to me. Okay, okay, seriously, here's the key. Uh, whoops, I just accidentally teleported to the elevator where you first came in. Open your missions with Y, then hover over the entrance and press A. What is this? I don't like having to use the joystick here. Can I switch? I can. Once we grab the key, you can quick teleport back Holding Y under normal seconds, this is this will teleport you to important locations. Now destroy the generator to complete your mission. Uh, are you gonna let me control me? Thank you. Hi. I 
bounces back in my face. Okay. Oh, that's gotta hurt. This has been a barrel of blast, hasn't it? Anyway, sorry for the hazing. You're, you're a pretty tough cookie. We only lost one person to this exercise. That's a new record. I guess you can join the resistance now. Congratulations. Speak to the doctor when you get in. We'll see about getting another bacon cheeseburger. Step to the elevator to come join us in our new home base. This game is weird. I don't like the controls. Didn't skip the tutorial achievement unlocked. Ah, get out of here. How unprofessional. Oh, those are... <laughs> I should have known those are bathrooms. That the one had a toilet. So I have a few other things to let you know before we send you out on a suicide mi uh, completely achievable mission of taking down the mayor. First, since you're new to the city, you should know that it's built in vertical layers like a lasagna. Slums at the bottom, then the industrial area, then the faux outdoor park downtown, and uptown at the top. The only way to get from one level to the next is through elevators. Second, in addition to your primary missions, we'll need you to do a bunch of other tasks for us. Upper butt pass from Birch! Hi, doggies! Ah. Oh, yeah, I'm good, 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 Scratch him, scratch him, scratch him, scratch him. Get him, 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 I need you to do a bunch of other tasks for us. Let me highlight it on your map. Like that generator you just blew up. Say you're going for the butt parts. You'll need to finish your missions on a floor before you can travel to the next one. Third, resistance leaders like myself will help you out by sending you rewards for completing these missions. But that's all about what we can do for you. We are less doers and more idea men. For example, it was my idea to send you out on this mission. So do me proud because there might be a promotion in it for me. Fourth, as you may know, the mayor has banned chicken nuggets due to the fact that they only caused him a mild tummy ache. <laughs> chicken nuts, nuggets have since become rare and precious commodity. If you can scrounge up some chicken nuggets, we can trade them for things that can help you out. The doctor, thief, and soldier can bring you a bit more, can brief you a bit more on the nugget situation. Or if you want to head into the city, the elevator is your is your to your north. Good luck to you, young rogue. Oh, and by the way, say to the occupied restrooms. That kind of activity embarrasses the resistance more than it does you. Whoops. Oh. Kitchen? Hello? You haven't lived until you a three-year-old chicken nugget. Gross. Your sweet membership has been declining since you implemented the tutorial. I only have three beds. Co-op. This is co-op? Okay. Have a good one, Birch. Thanks for popping in. Can I hack this thing? Nope. Is your marriage dating yet? Can you please hurry up on that? Traits. Bacon, cheeseburgers! Sorry, the last one was performing a long surgery. Hey, lied to me. Mutators, rewards, loadout. What the fuck? Can literally hack the whole game. That's how elite I am. Following that, the player continues the game from the beginning of the floor. Three continues per run. Starts after you complete floor one. Oh my god. Alright, this game has a lot to it. Reroll items. Unlock rewards. What the hell? Okay, so guessing it's a roguelike. 
Oh, I can change my person. Oh, and they have different traits. Potential to not suck. A random stat gains a point every other level up, starting with level two. Gain lots of extra XP, earn fewer chicken nuggets on level up. Health to gradually drain to below 20. Blods will attack on site, extra XP for killing Blods. Recruit maximum of three followers. Holy crap. Can use that weapons except for thrown items. What a strange game. Starting items, whiskey. Sure, I'll be her. Slums, go. These guys look like they want to do me a bonk. Okay, yeah, mate. they take a lot more damage than I thought they would. Bing, 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 bing. Bing, 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 bing. Boom. Got him. Oh, and I broke my way in, too. Do I have a hacker? Nope. I got a knife, though. Wait, was that a knife? It is. This guy looks dangerous as hell. Ook, ook, ook. Gorilla. Oh, it's a gorilla. Oh, you a friend. Where are you going? Retrieve item. Oh, I got a baseball bat. Let's use that. I don't know which one's better, but... Insert item. Syringe. I'm so confused. Ride with item. <laughs> Threaten. No. Don't want to do that. This game is very interesting. Those guys look like they definitely want to fight. Hello? When you steal something, at what point does it be truly become your own? I don't think I have... No, I have no money. Oh, I gotta rescue them. Alright, that guy has a bonk stick. Oh, him swinging. Oh, crap. Wrong button. It's not fair. I'm pushing the wrong button. Boop, boop, boop. Get him. Okay, there's the bed. Can I actually rest? Here you go. I'm freed prisoner. No, I wanna. Oh, I didn't need to use that. Heck yeah, I'm freeing prisoners. Am I recruiting them? Oh, heck yeah. They opened this. Thank you. I have no money. Hello. Oh, I got a cheeseburger. Oh, no, I ate that. So confused. Knock, knock. Oh. Oh, did my person come help me? Ow. Ah! Gun! Gun. Okay, that was scary. Did that person actually help me? That's kind of cool. Yeah, things happen there. Oh, he's breaking the thing. Heck yeah. I need to get back in there. Gun. Okay. Okay. 
Is that a bomb on the floor? Can I avoid that? Take me to the exit. All right. Is he coming after me? Definitely looks like it. Nope. Oh, level exit. I guess I'm close enough here. I guess might as well try it. Ignore all the people I've murdered. Yep, definitely not there. All these people moving. I don't know who's going to attack me. There's a sleepy person. I need health. Yeah, freeze ray. I don't have missions to do. You lie. Destroy all generators. Oh, damn it. Okay. Generators, huh? Why didn't I open this? Oh, there's boxing going out there. Ah, what? I uh, stepped on the trap. Damn it. Does it completely restart me? Because that'd be a bummer. Oh. Things changed. What is this? Oh. Okay. Randomly generated levels, huh? Now it's a retrieve item. Okay. That's weird. What's up, bruh? No, I wanted that. You made me waste my bullets. Ah! Almost stepped on that. How am I gonna get over there? Oh, bonk this. Yes. Got it. Got some muns. All right. Rescue the gorilla. I stepped on that trap and it didn't go off. Thank goodness. All right. Where's the gorilla friend? There's a zombie. Kind of scared to let him go. Gorilla friend? There's a chest in there. Hello. Get out of here. I need to help this gorilla though. You let me in. Oh, they, now they want a box. You guys are doctors. What are you doing? Did I just get a crit on him or something? What the heck happened there? Right. Ah! Didn't matter. Killed them all, so. Is that going to explode by itself? Yes. Sorry. You need to free the gorillas. Where's the... Is there a computer in here? Yes. Yeah. I freed both of them. Heck yeah, dude. Come with me. 
gorilla friend. Here you go. Look. Exit. Um. You don't want to exit? Sorry, I have to break into your safe. Damn it. Ex oh, to entrance, not exit. Damn it. Sorry, I have to come kill your thing. No, gorilla. Gorilla. Oh, okay. Well, we got to take you right to the exit or er, entrance. Because you had to throw some fisticuffs when the thing exploded. Here you go. Did it. Floor clear. Elevator open. Oh, I'm done. Oh, heck yeah. I don't want to know what's in this thing. Hmm. Can I break down the door? Oh shit, dog. Oh, she's shooting. Oh shit. Oh crap. Combat helmet. Oh shit. I can't switch. Jeez. Oh heck yeah, I'll take that. Oh, chicky nuggies. Anything else? That guy has an axe. Oh. Yeah, see, I didn't need to blow up the generators. It, it changes. Interesting. Innocence killed, too. <laughs> Angered eight. <laughs> uh, yeah, boy, you leveled up. Select a new trait for your character. Walls worst nightmare. Easier to knock people through. Knock people through walls. Oh, wow. Super target enemies have more difficult aiming at you. Infection spirit. Followers gain extra health. Slippery target. Okay. Now what? Rescue. Purple person. Operate all the switches and neutralize. Okay, so I'm going to go this way. That person has a gun. What the? Oh, I thought that was coming down from the sky. All right, you got to be neutralized. I'm going to try to rescue this person real quick, though. canceling it looks like it's gonna explode so <laughs> or that drop down bar makes it looks like it's gonna explode and it freaks me out getting us a doctor <sighs> I killed my own friend god damn it Why is that? Why is the whole? Why is the detonator got to be so explosive? I mean, that explosive. It seems a little ridiculous. And run. Oh, God. And then I explode. Current traits in the pool, minimum traits in the pool. Oh, 
that used the chicken nugget. Okay. Well, this game was interesting. I think I'm done with it, though. Because it's not interesting enough to hold my attention, and it seems kind of just too loose. I don't know how to explain it. Um, like, the level I went in, and then I failed it, so then it completely regenerates the level, which normally is cool, but it completely changed the objectives, which is kind of weird and... I don't know. It, it, if I was going to do this, I'd play like uh, Enter the Gungeon. Um, even though there's not like upgrades or Rogue Legacy because those have my attention. This one doesn't quite grab me. And I'm not sure why. There's just, hey, oh, well, there, wait, Gorilla Man. I kind of want to talk to him. Maybe I can just recruit him to follow me now. I don't know, but... Um, it was interesting. I don't like the slippery controls. That's the word I was looking for. Uh, not muddy, they're slippery. Um, and the aiming is kind of janky, but that could be just the controller. Um, but yeah, I don't know. That was, a uh, or Streets of Rogue. I'm glad I got it for free. Gotta give it a shot. So, if you guys were interested, go pick it up. Um, there might be more interesting stuff to it. I might come back to it, maybe give it some more play later but it just seems kind of there's like too much going on at the same time to choose from and it seems just kind of a little too much you know everything's just like blam available all right well i don't know how to play this so i guess i'm just gonna choose random things um but yeah that was streets of rogue so i'm gonna end the recording here